Crooners Supper Club continues its Lakeside Drive-In Concert Series on Wednesday. It has a little bit of everything. Blues, soul, Sinatra. We found out how the spot known for its live music moved to concerts from your car. What can people expect? Uh, they can expect, uh, for those of us who are of the drive-in air, it will be like when you went to the drive-in movies. You're going to park your car, but in this time of safety, um, the cars will be more like a checkerboard. So there'll be no car in front of you. There won't be a car right uh, next to you on either side because we want that six foot. The stage is actually going to be on an 18-wheeler flatbed. So it's going to be up like what you used to see at a drive-in movie. And you are going to hear music either by rolling down the windows of your car or you can turn on a special live streaming that we're going to set up so that you can listen to it in the radio of your car. We think it's going to be a great experience for people. It's going to fit with the governor's um, orders about safe distancing, but it's going to bring back live music, which is the spirit which all of us need right now. And um, it's going to give some money to the performers. Why is it important to entertain this way during this time? Well, I think there's a couple of reasons. One is we, of course, as crooners, want to stay in business. We are in the music business. Yes, we have a restaurant. But we're really a, a music venue. Uh, performers have been out of work in a sense they're not connecting to their audiences. So this is a excellent way to meet safe distancing, keep people safe, which is so important to us, um, as well as to give work to the performers. And can you imagine being in this beautiful setting and listening to live music? Sounds good. Next week's concert is a Mick Sterling doubleheader. He'll perform the music of Joe Crocker at four. It's followed by his Born to Run Bruce Springsteen show at seven. Tickets are $30 to 35 per person, not per car. Visit WCCO.com links for more information.